Hello everyone. Today we are gonna look at disk defragmentation. What it is, why do we need it and what it does. Before we jump into it, first you need to understand what is fragmentation. Fragmentation is the process of breaking a file into small parts. It makes your hard disk do extra work that can slow down your system. More simply, fragmentation occurs when a file is broken up into little pieces or fragments and fitted on the hard disk at several different locations. Fragmentation happens regularly because files are constantly being written, changed, saved, deleted and resized. People keep doing installation and deletion. Gradually both the file and the hard disk become fragmented and the computer becomes very slow because when a file is spread out over several locations it takes longer to read and write resulting in slower performance. It also affects the health of hard disk and decreases its life. Alright, let's get on to defragmentation. Disk defragmentation is extremely helpful to maintain the storage device and speed of the computer. Basically, defragmentation does two main things. It reassembles broken files scattered in different places and rearranges free space into one group. Defragmentation is the process of physically reorganizing fragmented files on the user's hard drive and putting them in the same physical location. Files become fragmented when data is stored on a hard disk and there is not enough space to hold the complete file. Storage algorithms break the data apart so that it can fit into available space. The process of defragmentation moves the data blocks on the hard drive around to bring all the parts of a file together. Defragmentation reduces file system fragmentation, increasing the efficiency of data retrieval and improving the overall performance of the computer. At the same time, it cleans the storage and provides additional storage capacity. Here is an example for better understanding. Let's suppose when you buy a new laptop or computer, you receive it with an empty hard disk. You start installing software programs, files, documents, music, videos and so on. Everything is keep storing in a sequence. At some point you decide to delete some of your data. Let's say you don't want to play your favorite game anymore. And when you remove it, it leaves the empty space. After some time, when you try to install a new file, if it's a bigger file, it won't fit in that particular space. So what system does, breaks it down into small pieces. And every piece is saved on a hard drive at a different location. And when you try to run that program, it takes much time to load. In that situation, you feel that system is not working properly. So it needs defragmentation. When you launch defragmentation program, it gathers all the related files that are spread all over the disk and put them together so that they are in the same physical location on the hard disk. And more importantly, it organizes the free space together in one place. After the defragmentation complete, system will work faster and load programs a lot quicker. Windows based computers require regular defragmentation. Unix and Linux based computers don't need it because of a different structure for storing data, even if similar hardware is used. SSDs also don't require defragmentation. Microsoft Windows provide built-in defragmenting tools within its operating system. Disk defragmenter in Windows rearranges fragmented data so your system could work more efficiently. It runs on a schedule, but you can also check and defragment your hard drives manually. Third party versions are also available such as Smart Defrag, Ultra Defrag, Perfect Disk and so on. Alright, so this brings me to the end of my video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.